Well, what a day it is. Uh, it's Friday, it's 75 degrees in Kansas City. What is this? Is this, uh, this is February 17th. 75 degrees on a Friday. No need for this fire pit here, but just uh, this show is on fire. It's so nice outside. I'm here at Prairie Fire in Overland Park, just chilling out. I wanted to do the first episode from Prairie Fire. It's really a special place for me. I like to come and hang out. Just got a really great vibe, uh, just with great energy, and uh, just really enjoy this place. And so uh, here we are, episode one, of the Ask Me West Anxiety Show. This show is all about answering your questions. All I want to do is make sure I answer your questions. Here we are, it's, uh, what is this, April 14th, and I'm excited to announce a new show. It's going to be, it's called Midwest Anxiety Daily, and uh, for all you OGs that have been following a while, it's going to look similar to the Ask Midwest Anxiety Show. I put uh, kind of the Ask Midwest Anxiety Show on pause. Gonna give it a breather. It just needs to take a break. Uh, but uh, Midwest Anxiety Daily is gonna be similar to that. Um, in the idea that uh, you're gonna just uh, be with me on a daily basis, traveling behind the scenes, behind the wheel, behind the wheel. Get it? I'm pointing to the steering wheel here. Because we're a community-based program, we're always in the community just doing various things, seeing clients in their homes and other places. And uh, so yeah, we're just starting Midwest Anxiety Daily. So uh, it's gonna be a lot of fun. Uh, part of the show, uh, a lot of the show, the reason why I wanna continue to do this is really for three reasons. First reason is I want to just give you cognitive behavioral nuggets, just little things maybe that unlock, unlock maybe just a struggle that you're having. Maybe there's something I say or there's a resource, um, maybe it's just, you pick up something that may be helping uh, you get through your day-to-day -day struggles. Second thing just inspire you to create that life that you want to live. That's what this is all about, to help you create that life that you want to live. And then third is to change the way that we talk and do mental health, guys. Just doing mental health differently out here. Just doing mental health differently. So, if we have a little fun along the way and we accomplish those three things, I think we're doing a really good job.